friends, this is the Mrs. Volfi from our Half Acre Homestead with another pantry pull meal. I don't know what to call it. We're going to call it mushroom spaghetti. Now, I wanted to make spaghetti today, but I know Howard gets tired of it, so I thought I would do something different. So here's what we got. In here, I have uh, three quarters of a pound of ground beef cooked and uh, a half a cup of onions. Here we have zucchini, two cans of mushroom soup, celery, and peppers. Let's do it. Okay, so I'm not going to water this down yet, but I'm going to put in some, here we go, put in some of our frozen celery. Nice big handful of peppers. jar of zucchini. This will help it to stay thick and add extra vitamins to your end fiber to your meal. So the hidden grated canned zucchini, the hidden vegetable. Now we're just going to put the mushroom soup on top and we're just going to spread that down over Now I'm going to add one can of water, maybe not even a full can, but what's going to happen is we're going to treat the, so you know what, we're making mushroom goulash, there we go. So as soon as this all comes up to a boil, and just before Howie gets home, we're going to add macaroni, dry macaroni. So we don't need any salt because of that amount of soup, but we're going to add our garlic powder. There we go, and some pepper. And this is on high. Mushroom goulash, that's what we're calling this. Alrighty, let's have a look. Oh yeah, now that this is all lovely and bubbling, Look at that. See how nice and soupy that is? We're going to add a cup and a quarter or so of elbow macaroni. And here, you know what? I think I'm going to put some more pasta in there because that really, uh, I didn't realize, that, well, I should have realized that the vegetables were also going to add water. So I'm going to say a cup and a half to two cups of elbow macaroni. We'll just stir that in there. Yeah, that's what we want. Now, this is extra sharp cheddar and mild, mild cheddar. I mix these together to, to give us a sharp cheddar without it being too sharp. So we're just going to mix that right in there like that. And then we're just going to Put this all on top. Have something different from regular tomato spaghetti or goulash. Alrighty. And cover this back up in about 20 minutes. That will be ready. Okay. It's been about 30 minutes since we put that macaroni and cheese in there. Oh, oh, oh look. This is a... Uh, a crock pot take on one of Howie's old favorite things he used to cook when he was a bachelor. He would cook craft dinner, hamburger, and onions all in a big pot and he'd eat and mushroom soup and he'd eat that all week, didn't you dare? So here is supper. Let's uh, make a plate up for Papa and we'll take it over to him. Alrighty. We will just pepper this. You can use it. It's so chunky you can eat it with a fork, but you want to use a spoon to get every last drop. What, what commercial was that? Chunky stew? All right, let's take this to Howie and see what he thinks. This is mushroom soup goulash. And yes, you can see it's peppered. Hot. Gracie. 
Greasy, back up. Oh, mouthy. Oh. Yeah, it's hot. Mm. Very tasty. Yeah? Better, better than regular goulash for a change? Awesome. <laughs> now, you got to give something to the baby. Uh, way too hot. Way too hot. Okay. Maybe we'll get some later. This is the Mrs. Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead, and that was your pantry pull meal for today. Mushroom soup goulash, approved by Papa. Mwah! Take care, God bless, and I bet you that entire meal didn't cost $3.50.